What's good, YouTube? It's your boy P Money. So the Blazers make a three-team deal um, that sends Derrick Jones Jr. to the Bulls, or no? Yeah, to the Bulls, and we get Larry Nance Jr. and the Bulls get a first, a protected first round from us, um, and the Cleveland Cavaliers get Laurie Markkinen, who they signed to a four-year, sixty-seven million dollar deal so all in all for the Blazers from the Blazers standpoint this was a win for them um, they get a little bit more versatility on both ends of the floor in my opinion especially for that bench unit they didn't really have much playmaking ability and I think Nance could do that in a limited role for the Blazers you know what I'm saying I think Ant will have to make that leap a little bit as a playmaker, but having Nance there will, will help with that for that bench role or the bench unit. Nance can also come in, say, if Robert Covington or Norm Powell ends up in foul trouble, I could see Nance being that first man off the bench if that happens. You know what I'm saying? I think he'd be a guy that can possibly play a little bit of three if needed and can be that four for sure and small ball five so just having that type of versatility is going to be big for this team this year coming up um guy's always been a solid defender you know what i'm saying a very good rebounder um that was that's been an issue the last few years with guys coming off the bench you know what i'm saying he'll be a guy that can get them rebounds you know what i'm saying Give us a little bit more possessions if needed or a li little bit less possessions for the opposing team you know what i'm saying so all in all i think this is a excellent move from the blazers um if they had any uncertainty with derrick jones jr and his role um that's that's mitigated now you know what i'm saying because we got a guy that will definitely fit into the role that's given to him better than what derrick jones jr would and I wish nothing but the best for Derrick Jones Jr. Um, I think that he just wasn't a fit for our team, unfortunately, with Terry Stotts as the coach. Um, I was looking forward to seeing how he looked with Chauncey Billups as coach, but we, we made this move, and it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? But I'm definitely with this move. Definitely a plus move, in my opinion, you know what I'm saying? Something... Uh, that could potentially make us players for a bigger move down the road at the trade deadline, you know what I'm saying? Um, my only issue with Larry Nance is injury. Like, he's a, a guy that deals with a lot of injuries, but other than that, when he's on the floor, this dude is a problem, you know what I'm saying? Um, somebody that you have to watch out for. I mean, he's improved on the three so we can space that floor for us a little bit more, get guys a little bit more open. So I'm just looking forward to this one right here. You know what I'm saying? How he fits in with the team. Um, I can see this being a very good move um, to allow the starters to get a lot more rest. You know what I'm saying? Um, I can see this this working out very well if he can stay healthy but i don't really have too much else on it this is your boy p money tell me what you guys think and i'm off this